In this video, I'm going to walk you through how to sell a put on the IBKR mobile app. And for this example, we'll be using Palantir. So we're in the options chain for Palantir and it's got your usual stuff, your puts on the right, calls on the left, all that kind of good stuff. So when you first sell a put, the first thing we need to look at is what is the expiration or days to expiration we're looking at. I generally look for anything that is between 30 to 60 days out. So we are going to look at the November 17th cycle, which is the monthly cycle for November. And you'll see here, because we're selling the puts, so we'll be looking at the right hand side. And you'll see here, we've got the Delta column by our strike prices, which is in the middle. If I'm selling puts and not selling a call against it to make the position to a strangle, I like to go around the 20 to 15 delta. And you can see here we have a delta of 18.4 and 12.2. So just to be safe for this particular example, and again, this is mainly for illustration purposes, as opposed to me wanting to trade Palantir and all these kind of good things. What we do is we select the $14 strike price which you can see here, we've got fairly liquid type markets where the bid ask is between $28 and $29. So a penny wide, which is really good from a liquidity standpoint. So we're saying here that I can make anywhere between $29 to $30 on this particular trade, which is pretty good. So if I scroll up and bring this section here, you will see that our uh, max loss is obviously 1,364, which is the strike price minus the uh, credit received. And you can see that my probability of profit is 89%, which is roughly around the 11-ish uh, kind of delta. Delta is a good gauge of your percentage chance of being in the money at expiration. So if we go in and click on the order button, that brings up your order form confirmation. And again, to confirm, we are selling the Palantir November 17th, $14 per, where your limit price at the moment is $29. And if we select here, you can see the mid price is 30, with a bid of 29 and an ask of 30. So I wanna to try to get a mid price of 30, and we're gonna to slide to submit this overall position. And you'll see here that the order has been submitted and is waiting to be filled. So what I've done is I've just gone in as I couldn't be bothered to wait and just went to the bid of $29 and we got filled on this overall position. So Palantir does fall below $14. I'll be looking to roll the position, adding a call on to make the position to strangle, all that kind of good stuff. So if you're interested in learning how to manage positions, I strongly suggest that you click the next video on the screen now, which will show you how you can manage positions that unfortunately do not go wrong. And if you don't see it on screen, the link will also be down inside the description. I'll see you guys in the next video.